All right, back at the park. Dug a ton of pull tabs. Here's my first interesting thing, key. Well, that's a heartbreaker. I thought it was gonna be silver. It was the right tone on top, but then when I got down to it, the tone changed. <clears throat> but anyways, silver plated. Looks like I got some sort of junk earring here. Well, I've got several of these in the past. This is like a feather earring. Sometimes they're silver. I can't tell what that's going to be, though. I'll let you know at the bottom if it's something good. Flower hair clip. At first I thought that might be like a little spur piece of jewelry or something. <laughs> oh, just a flower. Alright, I just found part of a watch band. Now it's coming up a three. And more watch band. That was a four that time. Well, there's a big old hoop. Oh! I thought it might have been real, but it's not. There's no markings on it, and it's you can see the copper or whatever under it. It's not very heavy. Jeff got a junker. Okay, I got a ring in the hole. This came up in 11. Is it going to be gold? Is it going to be junk? What is it? Oh. So a toe ring. That will probably be junk. Hold on, let me clean it up. What'd you get? I thought I had a gold one. Another piece of shit. I just got a toe ring. Let's see. Hey, look at that. Dueling rings. Hey, that's kind of cool for junk. That came up in 48 too, which is just under a zinc. Oh, yeah. So it's junk. Yeah. So if that was, that'd probably be closer to a nickel if it was going to be gold. Yeah. God, just ringing it out today. <laughs> oh, my gosh. A bucket lister. I can't believe it. Look at the condition of the. I thought I had a V nickel. <clears throat> and to be honest, I get them all the time. But man, here in Montana, you know how hard it is to get a shield nickel? <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. I can't even believe it. Let me see if I can get a date. Hold on. I'll have to get back to you, but I think it says 1866. So the very first settlement in Montana was 1841. That shows you how hard it is to get that coin here. Oh my gosh, that is amazing. All right, I finally got a chance to take a look at that shield nickel. It's a 1866, which is the first year. And it happens to be the version with the rays. And there's like little rays that shoot out, you know, by the five on the back side. Anyways, this is such a hard coin to get in Montana because I was a little wrong on my date before. The first permanent settlement in Montana was 1847, and this is in 1866. So, yeah, this coin is almost right around just like the beginnings of Montana when there was nobody here. So pretty stoked to have this coin. I was just telling my wife, you know, hey, this year I just want to get something a little older, you know, something like a seeded dime or you know, fatty Indian or shield nickel or something like that. I've got a whole bunch of, you know, barber dimes and shield nickels and, you know, early 1900s Indian head pennies, a couple in the late 1800s. But anyways, this is a, this is a bucket lister for me. So happy to have it. Anyways, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like button, give us a comment and make sure you subscribe so you can see the next episode later.